Yeah, do it, do it. Go for it. F tier has to be not tasted. Burger King. No, not tasted. We need to find out <laughs> better names. S tier? What, what can we call this? Tastes like uh, heaven? Tastes like cock. Yeah? Tastes like a new... Don't stop using those words. What, this cock? Are you, are you about... Is that... Is... Okay, we can do this tier list without him. Okay? Is this... Do you agree on this list, boys? I think this is good. Okay, we, let, let's just start. Burger King. I, I would say this is okay, I guess. For, for me, it's more like a ah, medium. It, it's okay. I can have it. But it's still better than McDonald's. I think we have to put this one on good for now. Dennis. I think I've had Dennis before. I actually think I've had Dennis once, but I can't remember what it tasted, so we have to see what it is. This looks kind of good. The burger looks horrible. I think I'm willing to put Dennis up there with, with Burger King. For fast food, it is pretty good. What is this? I've never heard about this. Essentially an ice cream shop. I never had it, so I can't. Really judge? Okay. I'll tell you about my experience of KFC. It was when me and Jeanette was in the States. We had some KFC. I was going in, probably putting the expectations a bit too high. It was chicken, yeah, maybe it's good. Yeah, it's fried chicken. Absolutely dog shit. Pure trash. I didn't finish. I threw it in the trash. Trash! It belongs in the trash. I tried it once more later in a different country. Might have been a bit better, but still no place that you should ever go. Olive Garden, haven't tasted. Red Robin, haven't tasted. Sonic, haven't tasted. What is this, Taco Bell? Is this Taco Bell? Okay, Taco Bell. Another experience that I can talk about. This was back in 2010, when me and Jeanette were on a road trip, and we had to stop to get some food. We stopped. Ah, taco. We were used to the Norwegian taco. That's good. We love taco here in Norway. That's what everyone eats every Friday. We went in. It looked kind of okay. N nothing more than expected. I tasted. And it made, made KFC look exclusive. It actually made KFC look like exclusive food. We need, actually we need to add back another tier. Not even food should not be made. It's getting its own tier. It, it, it's just horrible. Hooters. Again, me and Jeanette have been visiting Hooter, Hooters, Hooters, I don't know, doesn't matter, nothing special. I, I, I think this is mid-tier fast food. I think we're putting it on okay. Dairy Queen. But yeah, this one, it looks kind of the same as a uh, Burger King burger. That's what I would say. Really good. <laughs> Look at my face, I'm covered with junk, I, I don't care. I, I still haven't tasted, so I have to put it down here in not tasted. I, I can't judge, and I don't trust him. I don't trust his, uh, that guy and what he thinks. Popeyes? Uh, 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 no, Popeyes gets KFC rank. McDonald's? Okay, let me think here. We have to compare them to what we already placed. And it's obviously better than KFC. But I'm not sure if it reaches up all the way up to Burger King. I'm willing to put it up there with Ho Hooters at okay, I guess. Applebee's. I never had this. We could look. I'm already making my wedding plans at Applebee's, so we can see how things are going for me. We are here at the one, the only, Applebee's. And I am trying the most popular menu items, including... I have to see, say, when I see this, it looks kind of good at least. 
while I talk about the other food, it'll be okay. Next, we're doing the buffalo wings. They're both. They look wings, good. By the way, I always. We're putting it up here. Maybe up, up to up to gold like as well. For and remember when I say gold like, gold like fast food, not in like gold like food. Th this is way over Burger King, Dennis, McDonald's, Hooters, KFC, everything. Bar taco. I have to say when you when you see this place up first, it looks much more cool. Uh, looks like it is more quality than the other uh, restaurants, if we can even call it that. I think it's the best tacos made with a lot of love. Some of our cooks have a lot of passion for the food that we serve. I was born. It's in pretty South good. California. It looks much better. We can't get anything out from this this videos. I'll just place this in the middle. It's probably okay. When this, I need to freshen my memory as a bit there. When this. On November 15th, 1969 in Columbus, Ohio, Dave Thomas opened his first old fashioned hamburger restaurant. I think I remember now, this is a, okay, I guess. Fridays. In Norway, they have, this isn't seen as the normal fast food, like my dolls, they would, they would put this on a tier above McDonald's, Burger King, all of those fast food uh, restaurants. And I have to add in this, when I had Fridays in Egypt, when I was dieting for a bodybuilding show, I had ordered food at the hotel. So they came to the hotel, delivered 600 grams of chicken, 600 grams of steak every day. But one of the days, I decided I can have a meal out with the family. And we went to Fridays, because this was a place in Egypt where it's a lot of tourists, so of course they have Fridays. And I asked if they could make grilled chicken with spices on, of course, but no butter, no fat, nothing added, just grilled chicken and rice. So. I told the waitress that I wanted that, specifically said. She went back into the kitchen. She said, yes, that's fine, we can fix that. The owner of the restaurant, he came out to s and he came to the table and said, do you really just want grilled chicken with no sauce, no nothing, just grilled chicken and rice and some vegetables? of course that's what i ordered of course i want that are you sure he said it was like question mark question mark you can see his face he was a bit surprised and then he said of course we can fix that for you if you will take a picture with all the staff working here right now <laughs> i had to stand up stand there let's say this chair is one person i had to stand there smile be a good a good knut and then they served me the food I wanted. TJI Fridays, the gold-like fast food. Starbucks, let's see. Let me think. I think I've tasted food at Starbucks and it reminds me a bit of this. Let's see here. You know, when you're buying sandwiches like this in plastic boxes, this is what Starbucks food reminds me of. Starbucks food is down there with Taco Bell. I'm one of the IT network admins for Taco Bell HQ. I could technically put your stream on all the stores, monitors and register systems right now at all 8,000 plus locations nationwide. Don't do that, Danny, for, for your, for your own job sake. <laughs> Don't put this list on any monitor at Taco Bell. <laughs> Domino's, as I said, I had this once. It was, I ordered two pizzas. There was some trou trouble when, with their delivery, but they fixed. Okay, Domino's, I have to say, I have to give it some, take some points off. Cause I was in a state where everything tasted good at this point when I had this. Subway. And I think Subway, it's a bit better than McDonald's when it comes to taste. They have a bit higher quality, but it isn't much. 
But I, I think the tier list, I haven't tried any one of this uh, down here, so I don't think we should rate them. Can I open that picture on stream, Danny? Or is it something that shouldn't be... It shouldn't be uh, done, yes? <laughs> We're going live on the Taco Bell! Taco Bell, I'm sorry, can you maybe... Uh... Gravity pulls you straight down